Welcome to SG Spotlight, where we shine a light on the biggest names in music. Today, we're embarking on a melodious journey through the life and career of the legendary Eric Carmen. A talented musician who etched a significant mark in the industry, Carmen's story is one of passion, dedication, and an unwavering love for music. From his early beginnings to his rise to stardom, each chapter of his life is a verse in the symphony of his legacy. Buckle up as we dive into the captivating journey of Eric Carmen. Our journey begins in Cleveland, Ohio, where a music icon was born. Eric Howard Carmen, known to the world as Eric Carmen, was born on August 11th in the year 1949. He was a child who grew up in a loving home, surrounded by the melodies of his mother's piano playing. This early exposure to music was the spark that ignited Carmen's lifelong love for music. Carmen's first encounter with music wasn't just confined to the four walls of his home. He was constantly surrounded by the vibrant tunes of the 50s, coming from jukeboxes, radios, and television shows. This environment nurtured his interest and passion for music, and by the tender age of six, he was already learning to play the piano. His musical journey took a turn when he was introduced to classical music at the age of 11. The masterpieces of Rachmaninoff and Tchaikovsky left a profound impact on young Carmen, shaping his future compositions. His teenage years were marked by the British Invasion, the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, the Who, bands that would influence his musical style in the years to come. The groundwork was laid, the stage was set, and the young boy from Cleveland was ready to step into the world of music. Little did anyone know this young boy from Cleveland would one day become a musical legend. As Eric's love for music blossomed, so did his career with the Raspberries. This vital chapter in Carmen's life began in the late 60s in Cleveland, Ohio. The Raspberries, a rock and roll band, was formed by Eric Carmen and three other talented musicians. The band was a breath of fresh air in a time when hard rock and progressive rock were dominating the music scene. Their unique sound was a blend of rock with a dash of pop, a genre that later came to be known as power pop. Eric Carmen was the lead vocalist and also played the bass guitar. His musical prowess and distinctive voice played a significant role in shaping the band's sound. The Raspberries were known for their catchy tunes and relatable lyrics, a testament to Carmen's songwriting skills. In 1972, the Raspberries released their self-titled debut album, which featured the hit single, Go All The Way. This track was a massive success, reaching number 5 on the Billboard Hot 100 chart. The band went on to release three more albums over the next two years. Their second album, Fresh, featured another hit, I Want To Be With You, which also made its way into the top 20. Throughout their time together, the Raspberries garnered a loyal fan base and earned critical acclaim for their innovative sound and dynamic performances. However, all good things must come to an end. By 1974, creative differences and tensions within the band led to their disbandment. Despite the band's breakup, Carmen's time with the Raspberries was a crucial stepping stone in his career. It was during this period that he honed his skills as a singer, songwriter, and performer. The Raspberry's influence is still evident in Carmen's music, even as he ventured into his solo career. Eric's time with the Raspberries was just the beginning of his successful musical journey. His story is a testament to the power of passion, talent, and resilience in the face of challenges. And as we move forward, we'll see how these qualities continue to shape his career and legacy in the music industry. With the disbandment of the Raspberries, Eric Carmen embarked on a solo journey that would take him to new heights. The year was 1975, and the music industry was about to witness the rise of a new star. Carmen's first solo album, self-titled Eric Carmen, was a testament to his musical genius, showcasing a blend of rock and ballads that resonated with fans and critics alike. The album was home to two of Carmen's biggest hits, All By Myself and Never Gonna Fall In Love Again. 
These tracks, inspired by the works of Sergei Rachmaninoff, were lauded for their lyrical depth and emotive delivery. They raced up the charts with All By Myself reaching number two on the Billboard Hot 100. It was a powerful start to Carmen's solo career, one that set the stage for a series of successful albums and singles. In the years that followed, Carmen continued to make waves in the music industry. His second album, Boats Against the Current, gave us the beautiful ballad, She Did It, a track that once again showcased Carmen's knack for crafting heartfelt melodies. This was followed by Change of Heart and Tonight Your Mind, both of which further cemented Carmen's reputation as a versatile and gifted artist. The accolades were pouring in as well. In 1976, Carmen was nominated for a Grammy Award for Best Pop Vocal Performance. He didn't win, but the nomination was a clear indication of his growing stature in the industry. Eric Carmen's solo career was marked by a unique blend of rock, pop, and classical influences. His music was always deeply personal, reflecting his experiences, emotions, and most importantly, his immense talent. He was more than just a musician. He was a storyteller who used melodies and lyrics to share his world with us. Eric Carmen had proven his prowess as a solo artist, but his journey was far from over. Despite his soaring career, Eric Carmen faced his share of challenges and controversies. It was not always smooth sailing for this gifted musician, as is the case with many artists who hit the limelight. Carmen grappled with the pressures of fame and the music industry leading to struggles with alcohol and mental health issues. But, like the true artist he was, he channeled these experiences into his music, creating soulful melodies that resonated with his audience. As for his personal life, Carmen was known to be a private individual. He married Marcy Hill in 1988, and the couple had two children. However, their marriage ended in 2001 after 13 years, a period that Carmen admitted was one of the most challenging phases of his life. Yet, in the midst of these personal trials, Carmen never let his professional commitment waver. He continued to make music, showcasing his remarkable resilience and dedication to his craft. His personal struggles added a depth to his songs, making them relatable and profoundly human. Eric Carmen's life was a blend of sweet melodies and dissonant chords, just like his music. He experienced the thrill of stardom and the despair of personal struggles, but through it all, he remained dedicated to his art. Through all the highs and lows, Eric's passion for music remained unwavering. As the years progressed, Eric continued to make his mark in the music industry. His love for music never waned and he remained an active contributor to the art form that he held so dear. In the late 90s and early 2000s, Carmen collaborated with various artists, infusing his unique style into their work. His collaborations were a testament to his versatility as an artist, effortlessly merging his sound with others. Carmen also continued to release new music, his creativity remaining undimmed. Each new release was a reminder of his enduring talent and ability to create melodies that resonated with people. Beyond his music, Carmen ventured into other areas of the industry, sharing his wealth of experience and knowledge with younger artists. His influence extended beyond his discography and into the very fabric of the music industry. Even in his later years, Eric Carmen's influence in the music world was undeniable. Eric Carmen's music has transcended time, leaving a lasting impact on the industry. This dynamic artist, with his poignant lyrics and memorable melodies, has influenced generations of musicians and music lovers alike. From his time with the Raspberries to his successful solo career, Eric's unique blend of rock and romantic ballads has been a constant source of inspiration. His songs have been covered by a broad spectrum of artists proving his versatility and the timeless appeal of his craft. Carmen's influence extends beyond the charts, as his music has permeated popular culture, featuring in films, television shows, and even on Broadway. His dedication to his craft earned him recognition and several accolades, including induction into the Hit Parade Hall of Fame. But perhaps the true measure of Eric Carmen's legacy 
is the way his music continues to resonate, touching hearts and stirring emotions even today. Eric Carmen's journey is a testament to his undeniable talent and enduring legacy. From a young boy in Cleveland to a global music icon, Eric Carmen's journey is truly remarkable. His melodious voice, dynamic career and lasting legacy continue to inspire countless music lovers worldwide. From the Raspberries era to his solo success, Carmen's tunes have left an indelible mark on the music industry. His life, filled with highs, lows, and everything in between, is a testament to his enduring spirit. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Stay tuned for more insights into the lives of your favorite artists here on SG Spotlight.